This day in history of the Walt Disney World Resort for January 9th. January 9th, 1994. The Circle Vision film American Journeys closes. This classic 21-minute movie was shown at Walt Disney World's Magic Kingdom and shared a glimpse at American life through cross-country travel. This visually appealing video featured all American scenes, including beautiful New York Harbor, a bluegrass band from down south, and a whitewater rafting trip, among many other clever slices of American life. January 9, 1999. On this day in history, Horizons closes forever at Disney's Epcot. Originally opened in 1983, Horizons took guests on a 15-minute ride through the world of the 21st century. Guests could explore living in the future in three different environments, space, the ocean, and the desert. While it was probably the most appropriate attraction for Future World, it's definitely one of the most missed attractions by fans. The pavilion will be destroyed and years later be replaced with Mission Space. Who wants to be a millionaire? January 9th, 2004. On this day in history, the daytime game show Who Wants to Be a Millionaire begins taping episodes at the Disney MGM Studios. Millionaire, hosted by Meredith Vieira, is a television game show which offers $1 million for correctly answering multiple choice questions of increasing difficulty. Taping is held at the Who Wants to Be a Millionaire Play It attraction, which features an exact replica of the show's set, and audience members will have the opportunity to be part of the Ask the Audience Lifeline. January 9, 2006. It is reported that following a multi-million dollar renovation, the Royal Plaza in Walt Disney World Resort has reopened. The hotel had been closed since August of 2004, after sustaining damages from Hurricane Charlie. The hotel renovated its 394 guest rooms with new carpeting, drapes, beds, linens, bathroom countertops, and amenities. All the public areas now feature wireless internet access, new artwork, carpeting, tile, wall coverings, and furniture. The update also includes new landscaping and exterior repainting. And that's this day in history of the Walt Disney World Resort for January 9th. Be sure to catch the next episode. It includes the closing of one of the clubs on Disney's Pleasure Island. We'll see you then.